to YouTube to Cape Carcuda. I got the headlight uh fuck it, bezel, fender extension, whatever you want to call it. I got it to go in there. I have this side kind of flushed out. Nothing's bolted in yet. Uh see the top of my fender a little higher than the headlight bucket. If I uh tweak this up though, it misaligns the side. What I had to do was the doll pins in the inside. I'll show you. These doll pins, you see I had to bend this one. I had to bend it in. I had to kind of bring this one, bend it outward that way a little to give it that play. I had to bend this bracket outward. This bracket pivots on this one little bolt right there. So, uh, I had to pivot it and bend it out a little. So I guess those are the finer adjustments that you got to do. Uh, I'm going to bolt it up now and throw these uh, 3 8 bolts I have that came with the original. And then I'll uh, try to conquer the uh, actual head headlight box bezels themselves. See if I can jam them up in there somehow. Maybe if I... I don't really want to bend this right here that much. But I'm thinking if I do kind of bend it inward, maybe I can uh, get it to go past there. You see where it's hitting? It's hitting right there and right there and stopping. Almost if I uh, took like a grinder wheel or something like that, cut little notches in there, it probably fit in there. <laughs> or grinded those pieces off. Cause that's where it's hitting it's stopping on these goes right in there like butter but when you go to put it in here she wants to fight you 100 percent i was thinking is that how you're supposed to do it put it in the top first then smoosh in the bottom or you put it in the bottom part you put the bottom in like that i don't know she wants to fight me then I had to bend tabs on here too. I had to bend these outward, bend this one outward. So there's some playing to do with these to get them on there, right? I think weight, weight-wise too, GM's feels a little heavier. Just a little heavier. Ooh, mine had, it looked like that had some body work at some time right there. See it kind of crinkled right there. I didn't think that side was in that bad condition. It's got some pitting on it. It looks like if I uh, sandblasted it, it would have came back. The other side's got rot on it. And, uh, I'm going to try to button this up. It's got four. 3 8 bolts in it. Let's see the back of this. You have to take out with two Phillips screws. Take out these. Out. I gotta get some more of these square tabs. A couple of them just rot, dry rotted, cracked. Um, two Phillips screws takes these bezels out. Then when you go do that, you got a 3 8 in the corners and then one over here that's it four three eight screws hold this in after you take out the four Phillips screws that hold the headlight bezels out I didn't have to take my actual headlights out I'll show you where they go right here you got one right here this one comes from the inside the hood. Good to get it from there. And then you have one that sits in here. One right here in this corner. And then one right here. 
my screw thing is missing on this one, I guess. I'll have to see if I can have it. it might have broke. Yeah. It's right there. And that's the one I wanted to put in first. That's the one I have on this side. I don't have one screw holding that side in. Alright, Cape Cod Cuda signing out. Trying to get this front end together. Thanks for watching.